So this is Toa Garen. He's the Toa of edginess. No, he's the Toa of Earth. But he's pretty edgy. As as you know, he's he's based off of me, and I'm like the edgiest person alive. It's that's a fact. So Garen is another actual Toa. Um, not like some weird, not Toa or whatever. Um, and yeah, he is actually the Toa of Earth. Um, and I know he's not very like muscular, like an average Toa of Earth or whatever. Um, but he's supposed to be like sort of quick and agile and stuff and all that 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 edginess, you know. Just like ninjas, because he's he's like a ninja, and he's edgier than any ninja I've ever met, and I've met a lot of ninjas. Okay, so we can start with the legs. Um, and the legs, let me just like tilt my light down here. There, there we go. Um, I'm hoping this, I can edit this so it's like a bit, bit brighter, because he's like black on black, which I'm regretting. Um... He'll he'll be less black in an update. Um, so this is sort similar to a leg design that I've I I've done a lot before. Um, so then I realized that you know I'm using the same leg design over and over again. Maybe I should make it better or at least different. Um, because I I have had people say that my mocks are starting to look samey, um, and I don't disagree. Um, but it's just like, I, it's hard for me to get out of my comfort zone. Um, but, here, you can, you, I mean, if you can see that, you can just say however you like about it. You can comment or whatever, I'm not going to stop you. What else? Um, he has like, these, oh, sorry, lights in the way. Um, the, the Krana, Krana, right? Yeah. Um. This, this comes off a lot. I'm just going to leave that there. Um, so those are like... It's supposed to look like he's got a chain belt with these on. And um, when whenever I get around to writing a story for him, then I'll, uh, you know, explain that. And um, he has longer than normal thighs. Um, that was just because I wanted to use that certain piece. And it's hard to make, like, a short thigh with that. Um... And he also has this sort of, like, um, crotch flap. And, uh, no, that's not a euphemism. Um, that's just decorative clothing. And, yes, it's clothing. So his arms are pretty simple, just like, uh, CCBS bones. Um, oh, there. I'll just take these off because it doesn't matter. It's not like I'm hiding secrets or whatever. Um, so it sort of has this double-jointed-ish, um, arm function. Uh, I don't believe that, um, arms are actually double-jointed in real life. I'm not sure. I'm not a biology expert, so, do uh, correct me if I'm wrong. Um, but the way that I built it, it also enables it to do, um, sorry, this is hard to do with one hand. Uh, I should get a tripod. So you, hold on, yeah, you can bend it like that, I don't know if you can see that that, that well, um, you can bend it so it, like, sort of goes inwards, and, okay, uh, oh. you can bend it, there we go, my finger was in the way, but just take my word for it, it bends in a weird way, um, and this is, uh, yeah. <laughs> Probably the first thing I do when I update him is uh, change the arms because they're kind of not great, in case he hadn't noticed. I can also say, oh, sorry, the camera was focusing. Um, I can also say that I'm not disappointed in the back. Um, still, I don't know if you can see it because of, like, black on black, uh, but there isn't really much weird Technic things going on, and I actually covered it, and everything's black, so, you know, everything looks like armor. So he's, like, uh, kind of taller than most of my other mocks. Um, like, above average sort of thing. 
sort of deal. Um, so yeah, he's like, there, Liwa, and Alfred's about, like, up to his shoulder. Uh, his torso build, sorry, I'm, eh, there we go, lights. Um, his torso build is pretty similar to, um, another mock I've made, um, but actually it's, like, a completely different, uh, build on the inside. And, uh, personally, I like the look of this one better than the older version. Um, first of all, this one actually, like, it's not, like, super skinny, and there aren't many gaps at all. And if there are any, it's, like, not hard for me to fill them. Um, I might want to fill them sometime. Uh, here's a bit of a better size comparison. Um, and I'm not sure if... You've, anyone saw my uh Mikasa review but um there's a review for that uh and Yuren's a tiny bit taller than her and um Mikasa's like uh, let me just get there that there yeah that that tallish ye uh so his weapon is this um bent axe of edginess because axes have edges See what I did there? I also just realized that Yarn's, Yarn was missing a, a part on his shoulder, um, and I just now uh, cared enough to fix it. Um, so just just ignore that it wasn't there. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe if you like the video. If you don't like the video, then Either just, like, I don't know, don't finish watching it, or dislike it, or whatever. Um, and, uh, don't forget to comment and say stuff, and, uh, feel free to ask me questions or whatever, um, and I'll try my best to answer them. Um, so, um, this was fun. <laughs> uh, um, bye.